opting for the better main here. He's been dabbling in Pikachu a lot lately, and he's going to opt for it against Ben, the Duck Hunt. Yeah, Ben, newcomer to the scene. Okay. He's in a kind of aggressive brand of Duck Hunt, and today's looking like he's already sick of that Ridley. Yeah. Yeah, man, you, you know your faults of the character, and as long as you've got a, a top tier on deck against these wacky matchups, you need to go for that. Yeah, and I mean, Ridley, or Pikachu is definitely a style change, right? Trade all that range and power with, you know, all this elusivity right. and good at disadvantage. Oh, I love that hunt that, um, that, that can to cover that platform there to, to cover the quick attack in. Yes, yeah. Really, really good coverage. A lot of that spatial coverage out of Duck Hunt as per usual. That's sort of the name of the game with him. And for today's, who is, I'm going to say, still sort of a amateur Pikachu, yeah, he's going to have to figure this out. Yeah. Um, do you play Ben Duck Hunt? Uh, no. Okay, I, I know you, you like those zoner characters. I'm just curious. I, I like wacky characters. Yeah. I dabbled in Duck Hunt just to, like, give it a shot. Yeah. This character is too fucking weird for me, though. I'm not going <laughs> to lie. This character is too much. He, he, he crossed the line. Bro. Yeah, I really like Can. I like the mechanic of it. There's a lot of interesting things you can do with it. I like being able to manipulate an item on stage like that, but uh, a little too much zoning yeah, but, for my taste. But we are witnessing one of the weaknesses of Duck Hunt, one of the worst stock takers in the game. Yeah. Uh, doesn't add doesn't have many carryos and straight up takes stock. Right. Really relies a lot on um, setups yes. and pre corner pressure, which he has not gotten at the end here. Right. If you are familiar with uh, Smash 4, uh, Duck Hunt was the poor man's snake. Let's just right. say that. And he does not have snake up tilt in this no. situation. No, he's, stock. Not. he's right. missing those meaty normal hits, but the can will take care of stuff. Uh, very high percents like that was. Dash attack not quite going to do Lovely it. Lovely DI, man. Right. Oh, exactly. the double lightning. Okay. Oh, he's that air dodge. He Dude. barely made it back down. Okay, so similarly to Ness, not quite as ridiculous, but Duck Hunt's air dodge is actually a third jump. It is really, really, really good. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, got to hit the camp there. Okay, great back air. That's going to get him off stage. And actually going to kill, maybe air dodge into the last one. Maybe did a special move, something. But nonetheless, that's going to take the first stock. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it's so early for days. I mean, but now we get the combo game down throw down air. Oh. And another one. Can we dip again? Okay, bounce off the stage. Oh, try to go for another down air, but yeah, just gonna cover that get up with the forward smash. Really good option coverage from today's. Oh, air to the guy. landing. Wow. Yeah, really solo interesting usage of air, but I like it. It's refreshing. That, that's what's interesting when you watch like solo main try other characters. Yeah, they don't do the quote unquote that was correct, really narrow, right? correct <laughs> options a lot. <laughs> But you see some innovation sometimes, and sometimes it works out in their favor. Yeah. yeah, and there's a lot of room to work with with Pikachu. I feel like we're so used to a certain flavor of Pikachu, that, and there's a lot to work with. He's got a lot in his kit. Yeah, and Austin, I think we have Bueno. I think he's known yeah. as a more defensive Pikachu. Uh, other Pikas include, I think, is it mostly just Bueno? Yeah, and Austin, at least. Okay, higher recovery. I would have liked to see today's chase set down with maybe a down smash. Yeah. Uh, the Thunder, I don't think, was worth oh. it there. No, bad air dodge. Thought he was close enough to ledge, but inevitably was not. Tried the drag down there, wanted to confirm, but again, on, on top of it, right? And then, he this could really stack up his dunk cut, too. Yeah. Okay, there we go. The fair drag down into the down smash is going to take care of that. So, not too bad. This is uh, pretty even, and I think one good opening for today's can make something happen. I'd like to get an attack there to avoid that peak attack change. Nice. He's on the run, gets triple up okay. here. One of some crazy stuff. Yeah, triple man. up there, down. He's got the right idea with these combos. I feel like maybe he's just not following the DI enough, or just not getting enough drift on that. Okay. But he's on top of him, man. This is the game you want to play as Pikachu, especially against Duck Hunt. Zelda. He's good at zoning and keeping you out, but when you get in on him, he does not have fun. Okay, uh, unfortunately, today he's going to run to that can. He's going to put all this percentage. He's going to get that clay vision forward air. Ben, definitely nice. the percentage lead, but I mean, it doesn't mean a lot as Duck Hunt. Like we said earlier, the kill power isn't there. I'd say this is honestly in Pika's favor. Right. Oh, man. Just swinging in the corner was Ben, but he ended up getting hit for that. Okay, I'll let the aggressive. Oh, no way! The quick attack into the Thunder. I don't even think that was a confirm. Maybe it was just like not. a setup. It was a situation, but right, yeah. You get the quick attack, and you're like, okay, you're up above me. Yeah, I'm a button. swing. I yeah. think he swung with the aerial he, on the uh, quick attack. I think he did can, which is even more important because that's yeah. usually a get off me option for Duck Hunt and Thunder because of how I'm, I guess you can call it disjointed in that yeah. case. It opted as being the the best option to thwart that can. So good job for today's really solid first game. Yeah, absolutely. And now can, is the Ridley gonna come out here? I'd stick to the Pikachu if I were him, but all right, he's going to dabble into a different character. I personally have not seen the today's Sephiroth, 
But if it's anything like his Ridley, which this character is somewhat similar to Ridley, I think it's going to bang. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, Sephiroth really Garoui values players that are cracked in advantage. Yeah. You know, you know Octo Slash in general is, like, very similar to Red Ridley Upbeat, right? True, yeah. You should find that in good moments, like, you can just end stocks. Uh, yeah, I never thought about that, but this could be a good switch for today. I, I can almost guarantee you one cracked Octo Slash this set is going to come out. Oh, yeah. Either he's going to hit it or SD at 30. But if he hits it, today's is going to be feeling himself so much that he'll continue to go Sephiroth in his but back. Unfortunately for him, one thing about this matchup in particular, you're a tall, light body against yeah. Duck Hunt, right? So you're going to get hit by a lot. You're going to be hit by a lot, and you might die to some Duck Hunt stuff that might normally not kill. Right. And we're, he's struggling to get in him right now. He's getting ledge trapped really hard. Yeah, and this is Ben's counter pick to FD2. He's got a lot of space to set up, no platforms for you to hide under. Hard yeah. to land. I mean, I know Sephiroth has some mix-ups with the wing. Oh, now he's getting going, though. He's going to go yeah, down. There you go. Very nice back air to cover that. Got caught in this can play there. I think he hit the can and left right. himself in lag, and the Sephiroth back air was the perfect choice for today's. Yeah, there's a little bit of sauce to get lost from that can, and uh, unfortunately, that was Ben's first stock. Love how that uh, first level fireball went over the can. That, that normally absorbs projectiles. It's right. actually a really good oh. anti-projectile tool. Yeah. Alright, but now today's done the oh, hunt. That's right. right. Yeah. I told yeah. you, bro. He's gonna go for one. It's hey, look. Solid thought. But you were feeling yourself a little too much in that moment. Uh, hopefully, he doesn't let that slip away now. Because Duck right. couldn't get that precision. But now he's without a jump. Octo Slash here. I would have loved him wait a bit to use the Octo Slash up. Covers that. Right. So, oh. Tiller gonna get him off. He's gonna go for the full charge here. Oh, I think he's got an edge guard there. Yeah. Right. So, Duck has about a jump. Got to take advantage. Instead, he opted for the, the, uh, the level two fireball. Okay, gonna hit that can. Still has a 70% advantage. Not bad. Ah, I don't like this position for today's man. You gotta get back to the stage and be a little patient. Find your way in. Right. Said Ed tilt, but man, the end, the end is kind of 100% down the last 10 seconds. But that attack, great burst option from Sephiroth. Definitely. And uh, again, similarly to Ridley, he's got a lot of very similar options at those moments. Like that burst dash attack to seal out stocks is. Good. All right. Can nice. set up here. Nice. No fear. Just right. Gonna go ahead and cover that. But the nice Centella there to get him some space. Uh -oh. uh, doesn't get the double clay pigeon there. That would have been crazy damage had he been, or maybe a kill confirmed. Oh, the, up, the up B in as a movement option. Yeah, I like man. that. There's some mix with the character. There's definitely some mix, and I love to see the style from Ben. The can is gonna take care of it. Thank God. I mean, he's Sephiroth at 180. I would sure hope that that move would kill. Okay, gets a level one on fire. Okay, gonna take this play pigeon, nice. but nice until they interrupt the combo. Yeah. Okay, right. love the uh, level two fireball there. That actually could have two frame, but luckily right. at the end getting grounded. But it's actually kind of zone breaking too. It's interesting. Yeah, I think it's got priorities over a lot of projectiles. Right. Oh no! <laughs> Not like this. Not like this, Jason. Oh. I'm not saying I like sealed his doom, but Loki I, look, I, I have to chalk that up as a misinput. There's no possible way that goes through your mind that you were gonna end it all right there in that position. I think he actually went for it. There's no way. Going, <laughs> Jason. Yeah, get get your ass back on that rack. Come on. Damn. The Sephiroth was doing work, but way too ballsy. Yeah, bro. Hello, sir. <laughs> Saying what up to Bobbles real quick. I know he went for that. That makes it so much. Better. We'll see. We'll see. All right, Jason. We'll see. But now we got game three. The, interview. the rat is back out. Yeah. And yeah, I mean, it's not like Ben did bad against the rat. I mean, I thought he pushed it pretty hard. Today, he's yeah. just got that thunder read. Right. Dude, he loves that move. I'm but glad he does because it's a great move. Yeah, I can end. Okay. It's one like. I mean, Pikachu has a lot of quote unquote cheese you can get with Bear, but Thunder is like the ultimate cheese. You, you can take stocks insanely early with that move. It is a very strong move, yeah. And especially in the way that Duck Hunt is kind of susceptible with his recovery, that is great. We just edge guarding against we, we, that recovery. I mean, we said it. <laughs> like, exactly as it happens. Yeah, I mean, stage spikes, kills early, yeah, there's man. a lot for you. You gotta be ready for it. And that's what you need to do in this matchup. Duck Hunt does not have the hitbox coming up. Right. So, and as Pikachu, your edge guarding is top tier, so you have to be out there chasing that dog down. No. I'm doing it right now. Pikachu with rage. Okay. Uh, that's really important, too. The Thunder Jolt being able to knock away Cam like that just completely deflates that move for all the priority that it has. Good, Ben. Getting that 
can set up a Pikachu. Unfortunately, one thing that's unfortunate in this matchup is Pikachu has a lot of ways to escape the corner. Yeah. So those like bad ledge trapping setups that you know stuck out typically push you on just quick attack in. Yeah. You can Thunder Drill and then chase behind it with the quick attack and get not only deactivate the camp but get past it to get in too. It is okay. definitely one of those matchups. And Jason going for the ledge drop to Eric Thunder really trying to end the stock. You got the rage, so you might as well swing big. All right, I gotta say, today's quick attack usage out of disadvantage is actually really good because his angles are very smart. It is, it's an insane tool of disadvantage. I mean, this this is, it has a hitbox, you yeah. teleport, you can go multiple Two directions. directions. Yeah. It's, like, it's it is literally an insane offensive and defensive tool. Yeah, man. Uh, I would love to see today's playing more of this rat more than the dragon, but... Oh, I don't like... See, I... Sometimes I see today's instead of reacting to Ben Zonshin, he's just going for preemptive edge. He's gonna get it there. Thunder. He saved him. Are you kidding? He was dead. This is now three stocks total that have been flubbed for Jason, and uh, that would have been a whole another set he could have win. Okay. Even with okay. The oh, no. oh, he I traded with the can to knock him the other way. That was insane. I thought I was going to do it. Yeah. Nice. God. Why Pika has a kill throw as well as everything else he has? Why did they have to make that the fucking cry for the dog? I, I hate that sound, man. It's, it's pretty it's, brutal. It's, yeah, it's but there are some ranting, man. pretty brutal kill screens in this game, though. No, oh, that, kill screens. That's one of the worst. God. I think it's like bottom or top three with like Roy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Roy is definitely. You just really feel in your soul. Yeah, I think Roy's the worst, but like there's some <laughs> other ones that are. I think Duck Hunt is definitely up there. Honestly, so when Wolf dies, it will. Oh, true. True, that is a good one. That's a classic too. But I mean, Ben, he was down a lot. He's, he's brought this back. Right. Today is going going for all the crazy uh, Thunder Reach, man. This guy is relentless as we expect. And he's starting to get a little antsy with the quick attacks getting back in, but it, it worked out in his favor, but I feel like Ben's going to catch on to that. Okay, fair's okay. there. No jump on this duck. Let's see how he can take advantage. Guard. He's using the cut, the K, the K wow. coverage, but... I only can do so much. He thought he'd uh, air dodge in and say air dodge to ledge. So right. good um, decision making from Ben to nope. knock it as guarded there. No way. He did not go for that setup. He did the up tilt, waited for the air dodge, and went for thunder. Today's thunder usage is, again, I'll use the word, very refreshing. But it's his favorite move. Trade. Okay. But ben, this is not over yet. Duck Hunt has a ton of damage output. He can find a crack in neutral, but now we have another opposite situation. Today's has thrived off this all set. Yep, Not gonna die from up door here. Nope. Nice. Okay, that was definitely missing. Place. Probably wanted to press the red button instead of the yellow or the green button. Up door will do at this point though, so you yes. cannot get grabbed if you're bent. Uh oh. Okay. Trying to get the confirm. Yeah. yeah so dash attack will take care of it. Lucky for today's. I mean, I, to an extent, lucky. He's lucky that he didn't mess up some more because that second game, he completely flubbed it.